Within the Kendrick Mansion, there are several rooms that are unseen to the public eye. One of these blocked off rooms is the boiler room. The boiler room is located in the mansion's basement. The room contains lots of large pipes that lead up through the other floors for cooling, heating, and water supply. The room even includes an incinerator built by Cone Manufacturing. Other machinery in the room includes the boiler, external water boiler, and hot water heater. The boiler, built by Crochelle Brothers Company, functions as a closed vessel which in this case heats water until steam is generated under the pressure and then used for external use. The external water boiler, manufactured by the American Radiator Company, functions by using thermal expansion principles to bring warmth to separate parts of the house through a series of pipes. The incinerator simply burned unwanted items into ash, taking up less space in the trash can. The hot water heater took in cold water through the dip pipes, then heated the water and pumped it into different parts of the house for things such as baths or washing dishes. Separate parts of the equipment found in the boiler room were supplied by different companies, but were all brought in by railroad. The coal needed to heat the house was locally supplied by Model Coal Yard for about $2.50 per ton. Due to inflation, this is very similar to how much we pay now for a ton of coal, which is around $58. One of the Kendrick's bills shows that in the month of February 1914, it cost five dollars and sixty five cents for around two tons of coal. The coal was dumped through the manholes behind the house. It was then shoveled into the boiler room for usage. Even with the change from coal to locally piped gas in 1926, the heating system still wasn't big enough to handle heating the entire house. Diana, Manville Kendrick's wife, even mentions having an electric heater in her room in a 1949 letter to her mother. However, the boiler room still served the house well, even though visitors can't go in and see the maze of pipes down in the musty, dark, concrete basement. It continues to be a very important foundation of the house.